you pay for your sins? Triple Gate of London. Might find an official worth his salt here. I beg patience, all. We'll have this rack cleaned up in no time. Keep it steady, huh? Your love. Hey, bear our master, Ami. You'll be on your way shortly, huh? Something of a shepherd, aren't you? <laughs> I can feel that way, aye. Can I help you with something? Who governs this burr? I would like to speak with him, if I can. Ah, the governor Trigger. Good and fair day and come to London four years back. Trigger? Aye, most hours of the day you can find him at the old villa, <laughs> dealing with old manor and Avery. Stow! Avgus wants his cut of the summer harvest. Shit, Carl. <laughs> huh? What's the hold up? We're talking. Gentlemen, the farmers of Mercia have paid their burden already. If Avgus wants more, he can petition for it. Petition for it? Well, you can tell that old mud merchant. And if he wants his apple, he can bob for it. Belongs to Master Ame, sir. Bob for it! That is filthy. Bob for it! Come on, so 
London. Now, we've a quiet day once in a great while. And try not to kill anyone, eh? I'll wear your face as a skull cap stone. Watch your head there. Eyes on your own, foe. God in heaven, you fight like the devil stole in your bread. You give some hard knocks yourself. Rold, be a good lad and prick the names of those that pay their food tax, will you? Right then. You've some dealings with Governor Trigger, was that it? I'll have dealings with any who can deliver a fair friendship with my Raven clan. If that's you, then all the better. Ah, no. Trigger's your fellow. I'm the Shire Reeve of London's westerly half. I keep things ordered and fair. Shire Reeve is not a name that rides easy on the tongue. Reeve's my title, sorry. Stow's my name, Stow of London. It's good to meet you, Reeve Stow. London sits on sturdy shoulders. Uh, to be fair, I'm not the only Reeve. There are two of us now, and the Governor to boot. We do our best in these times, wild as they are. Take me to your governor, Stowe. He sounds like a man worth knowing. Right then. Station field, flock shepherded, and off to Trigo we go. What can I call you? Humbler of thugs? Dane Hammer? I am Eivor, of the Raven Clan. We have a settlement to the north, just off the River Neen. Well, I owe you a great debt, Eivor. You're a worthy ally. So this is London, a city built by giants. So they say. She's an old place, as early as they come. But there's a mystery here I quite adore. I was raised here, in fact. Learned the scriptures of Christ's apostles in Nundinwich. I was Saxon Burra, just past the Western Walls. You're not a priest, are you? <laughs> no. No, no, I was raised by them. And for a penniless bastard, it turned out pretty well. A penniless bastard, and now London's fearless Reeve. Well, it's Trigger who saw something in me. He judges not the circumstance of my birth. His two hands, left and right, are me and a Dane-born soldier, Erke. Erke's an orphan of the last Viking horde to put down in London for a season. Two or three years back now, it must have been. It's through Trigger I met Erke, and now we Reeves walk the city like parents looking after our children. A native son, and an imported Dane. See, London's a city built of many pieces. Wait. Something's wrong. Iron on the ear. This blood is fresh. These were good men. What's happened here? God, no. No, no, no. It took three arrows to kill him. The next twelve were an insult. O oh Lord, deliver these men with the light of thy countenance visiteth and shines upon them. You've no need for outsiders, Stowe. It's a private matter. There's no cause to be leery. Eivor had my back in a brawl at Cripplegate. More thugs from the garrison. Hmm. You must be a real broker to hold your own against those shit hugs. It's time to fatter those men, Stowe. It can't go on like... like this. If this one had a head, you'd be calling him Trigger, yes? Your governor? God above, the man is dead. Some respect, please. We'll get along well, you and me. You must be Erke, London's second Reeve. Erke Bodelson, yes I am. Are you telling me this gut bucket called me Second Reef? First, in the Eastborough. And a man I trust with my life. Stowe's never been a good judge of character. Erke, this is Eivor. She came to meet with Trigger, to seal the bonds of friendship with the clan. He would have welcomed you heartily. He was a trusting man. And I got him here. Have you found anything? I just arrived. The killers left a ladder on the body there. I'll have a look around. Trigger had men with him at all times. How could the killers get through? I must have been known to him. This letter. Someone wanted us to see it. 
From Rome went an order of heretics who worshipped the relics of a time before Christ. Erge, this was the letter he told us about. Said it contained fearful news about London. It warns of free such heathens who have infiltrated London. His killers, I expect. There must have been known to him. Well enough to get close without suspicion. Good and holy Christ, there could be most anyone. He governed this bird. Oh dear. What is it? Doing notes from a mistress. Sorry. Mistresses. <clears throat> Intriguer's desk. Ah, oh, yes. The old man has a wandering hand. And I... I didn't know. I didn't think. He didn't want you to. It was his secret to keep. Three sets of footprints leave. Two average, and one massive. Besides, in other parts, we paint the city's faded bricks. No. A barber surgeon's tools. Sharp and precise for easy butchery. Must have been what was used to free Trigger's head from his neck. I do not envy this man's death. Hang on, there's something in his hand. This was not Trigger's seal? No, it looks Roman in origin. It must have been on a ladder he opened. It must have been significant to this god for him to grasp it, even in death. Mayhaps it's what got him killed. I think I have a clear idea of what happened here. Trigger was shot where he sat, probably as he read the letter. One of his guards grabbed the seal and tried to escape. He didn't make it. A second killer found him first. He met his end at the noose, lifted by the bigger man. A third attacker took his eyes, then came for Trigger's head. Symbolic, maybe. Headless leader, eyeless guards. The killers were without fear. This kill was a message. Their footprints leave together. Three sets heading back to the courtyard. The letter mentions three heretics, named only by monikers. The leech, the arrow, the compass. Signed by someone calling himself a poor fellow soldier of Christ. Poor fellow soldier. Odd name. Three names, three killers, as you said. Baldersack. It could be anyone in London. Who can we trust? Only the people in this room, I fear. Even that would be unwise, until we know more. The arrow is described as a pugnacious Dane invader. That describes too many in London. The leech hails from Vesex. London is home to many of them as well. And the compass, a Frankish captain. Less common, but no face comes to mind. What is this symbol here? I recognize that from the Mithraic temple. I passed it on the way here. Mithraic temple. Is that a church? A church? Heavens, no. Mithras was a pagan idea. A so-called god beloved by the ancient soldiers that built this city. Our city is overrun with cowards. We may be next to fall if we don't resolve this sick fermentation of hate. I've told you, this city answers to blood and power. We should serve as such. I can't leave him like this. He's... I need to. We'll get the church to see to it, Stone. No. No, it should be me. I must ready him for judgment. I understand. 
We get some air from time to time. It reeks in here. Shall we, Broga? The gods have been murdered! To arms! Defend the Ah, oh, well, now the locals have caught a whiff of this fatted mess. The temple is yours to explore, Eivor. It's to the east of here. I must wear my Reeves face for a time. Keep away! Keep away! The fight is over! Town Hall will follow soon. Should the Reeves change their minds, I will have to gut them and put a puppet atop London's throne. But Stowe seems a good man. I will trust his word. What see you, old friend? The Temple of Mithras, well guarded for a tank. You are all the... Mithras, well guarded for a tangle of old ruins. I need to find the entrance. Tools for a surgeon, finely crafted, like we found in the villa. And there is a letter here, arranging payment to a blacksmith. The compass holds sway over the others. He has ordered the arrow to recruit archers in a market to the west. Worth a visit.
messages between the leech and the compass. Healing, gutting, the leech is a strange one, but the compass calls the strikes. I've got enough to go on for now. Erke and Stowe must see all this. I see more bloodshed in London's future. At least soon and we'll feast. I should not be seen in this area. It's worth knocking on a few doors, that's all I'm saying. Trigger wasn't killed because you want to plant a few trees and fix a few roofs in London. Looks less like a meal for crows in here. Hey, what? You bring good findings, I hope? A few sheets of vellum, notes between members of a secret society. The Order of the Ancients, they're called. Order of the Ancients? Doesn't sound any bells in this head. What's the purpose? That would take some time to explain. But know this, that I am here to kill them. In London, it seems the compass is the head. The arrow and the leech are his hands. Pet names and secret orders. What a crock. Do we know anything we can act on? The arrow is a Dane who has seen his share of battle. His name suggests that he's an archer. <laughs> I'd bet my knuckles he's the one sowing discord among the Danes that shelter in London. If it were me, I'd hide among my ranks. Surrounded by other fighting men. The Arrow has orders from the Compass to recruit soldiers at a market in the West. I know the very place. The Leech has need of flesh. Been looking for thralls, though I can't say why. We found a number of dead down by the Keys lately. But not thralls alone. Some of the missing we find again in several places. Cut to pieces. Good lord, Erke. The compass is a mystery. He's mentioned often, but there's little to go on. Said he was a Frankish captain, did you? To find him, we'd have to mark the ships that came and went along the Thames. Captains are a transient sort. It may be he's far away, keeping quiet. That may be, but would he scream if we cut off his hands? Oh, you've a filthy mind for strategy. We kill the arrow and the leech, then sit back and wait. Let the compass come to us. Let's not waste any more time. We will find the arrow and the leech. Killing both should drag the compass back into port. Stowe, I'll catch you at the Western Market. Count on it. And I'll make for the keys. There's another few bodies there to fish out of the muck. It could be the leech is back at work. God be with us, friends. Go in his name and be protected by him.
Best not to draw attention here. Is this the leech's work? Yeah. New corpses every day. If you are the only target for your people's fear, then they will turn on you. They're scared. If I am to be redeemed, I owe them the leech. How many bodies is that now? A score have been uncovered. Definitely the leech's work. How can you be sure? Their eyes are scooped out. Black, empty caverns. Same as Trigger's gods. There must be hundreds of people passing by here each day. Anyone see them dumped? It's the riverbank, Winner. Every crooked dealing in this city goes through here. Heard from Stowe yet? About the arrow? The leech is my focus just now. Does something worry you? Ah, no, just checking up on the old sparrow heart. You two are close, like brothers. Yeah, yo. Yeah. Close like brothers, you could say. Erke! Tell me it wasn't her! It wasn't your daughter, dear Kida. Take a breath. Oh, thank Freya. I have such a fear I will find her down here. She works errands for a smith who sends her to these docks. Most times at night. I cannot stand it. When did she go missing? A few days back. Left after sundown. Never came home, my Regna. Gods, if I could see her again. I haven't seen her in two days, and feared the worst. In London, you must always fear the worst. What sort of job did she have? Ran errands and the like. She would make a delivery, trade it for hack silver, and scurry back to her smithy. Do you know the name of the man? Name. But I wish I did. I would box his ears and harvest his nuts. Anything else you remember? I had a neighbor once tell me she saw Regna, lingering for a time under the London Bridge. Worried me sick hearing that. That's a good place to start. Thank you, Gida. A shady smith, a missing child. It's a lead with some weight. London Bridge after sundown. It's worth a look. Good. I'll hang about here and keep things calm. And Eivor, don't drop your guard around these dogs. Do I look like one who could? What's that song? Follow him. See where this leads. <gasps> Can't this clod walk any faster?
careful now. Is this the place or... No, just meandering. I must be careful now. Then take this soul! I'll sound the bell! Blood bag! Yeah! 
Don't fight. You got the purse I'm old. Huh? Who the fuck are you? I'm a friend, Oya. Your money's with your lad. What have you to do with him? I'm keeping him safe. Had a fear he was being followed. Tch, I knew he was soft. Not like my other girl. She was hard as hog's breath, that one. What happened to her? Fell ill a few days back. So I sent her to good Sister Friedeswith. Healer in town. Sister Friedeswith? Got broken bones? A boil on your bum? Or too much birth blood? She'll mend you quick. She would need a broad set of tools for such work. She would. And she has it. Comes to me for all her wants, and I craft for her what she needs. Not anymore, you don't. Alarm! We are being raided! Sunan, guide me. <clears throat> Shouldn't be seen. Better be hooded. This is where the leech dissects her prey. Meet This is where the leech dissects her prey. It's only a cop. The braids of Freya. Where's Julian at first? No! The braids of Freya. We'll wear you out, Nithing.
mail this. Come on, then. Please, please. My aunt came here for her cough. She never returned. It's been days, and we'll see her. Get out, and don't come around here again. Shoot the troll kissing coward! War guide my blows! Back to your nothing. One more, that's all. I'm nearly finished. That's enough. Oh, it's you. For all the dead we collect, dear sister, you and I are equals. Quite a charnel house. I I'd lost count of how many. I suppose I've been greedy in my research, but not for lack of care. The ancient ones. The Arbiters. They built us out of simple pieces. So easy to break. So difficult to mend. There must be an improvement. We should be stronger. Faster. Smarter. I could have fixed us. I could have made us better. We are blood and bone and spirit, freed us with. Perfect as we are. You've such beautiful eyes. Finish it. Would you? Scum! and welcome.
smart of you to keep honing your skills. Finish looking around. I'm off. Be well, friend. This area is off limits. It is done. Ah! The leech is bled out. And did you catch a name? A nun. Name of Friedeswith. What? The good sister? That can't be right. She was a saint. A healer and a... <laughs> God! That brick fits this week's wall of shit. All of that for this. Secrets of the human form. How she saved lives. And how she ended them. It might be the ravings of a madwoman. Not every problem has a clean solution. True. Very true. I've built my name selling the hard fix. I'll live with it. This was her fix. All her ideas and discoveries written here. Ill-gotten gains. I have a mind to burn that bloody tone. Is that the right call? Too many died for this book. It isn't worth its weight in blood. You're right. It would be like plucking straw from shit. Too much bad with the good. Odin and Freya weigh the worth of our lives, not some cunt in a wimple. Aye, get rid of it then. And tell no one of this. If you need me, I'll be at St. Paul searching for something on the compass. Thanks for all this, Broga. Anyone? I'm stuck! 
Ernest Nevan. On fin he ya, an mel ya ni. Tonne we de ich his heat quick ne be swing an. Be swing an ne ma dilemas. Anyone? I'm stuck. Barry's balls. That's foul. I hear you. What is wrong? Thank the gods! I wanted to get the new shipment done early, and accidentally boxed myself in. If that is all, I can get you out. Not so fast. Avoid breaking the jars. The sauce is delicious, but smells like a sun-soaked fish barge. Please, make a path through the jars so I can get out. And, and don't break any. The smell is awful. Swiga and the open at This place you have been stuck for a certain time. In the shell, walk away, my mother's. Fuck the gods, you've unblocked me! You've given me my freedom. But at great cost. Still, you have my thanks. Ach, sick, I... Eivor, welcome to the West Market. A lawman like you could set folks on edge in a square like this. Why not wear a cloak? Hide my face? Not a chance. It does the people good to see a lawman in the hunt. You and Erke found the identity of the leech. Some holy healer. She was called Friedesvith. Had an appetite for eyes. If this order can corrupt London's favored saint, what hope do we have? Any noise yet? About the Aero and recruits? I've heard whispers. Somewhere here, a man gives you a coin, and this coin grants you entry to a contest run by the Arrow's men. Which man? I see too many here. He's good at blending in. I haven't spotted him yet today. I'll sniff around. You stay back. Eivor, what was your impression of Erke? You suspect him of something? I don't know. Whoever killed Trigo was a close friend, and... It was Erke who found the body. I know Erke so well, and I can't bear to think he'd do something so vile. But... Then don't. Wait for proof before you condemn your friend. Ah, forgive me. My latest thoughts have been restless. I've been a reeve for so long. Fighting for God's justice. I shed my earthly attachments for his great plans. But... But you couldn't shed Erke and his friendship. No. No, I'm not sure I could. Good to talk. Unburden your soul. 
Clears the mind and lifts the weight off the chest. Yes, indeed. And thank you for listening. I should find one of these coins soon. Will you be around? I'll return to St. Paul's just down the road. Godspeed, Eivor. You got the coin? Try to die well! On shoulder. Session on in for not Odin owns you! is engraved with an image of the London Colosseum. Come, see my wares. You never know when this might come in handy. Happy to take this off your hands. Nothing else? I must be on my way now. Goodbye. Seen him around my mum's house. Hopeless. Thinking they can stink up the place. What's your business? Shooting or watching? You're looking for skilled archers, and now you've found one. This contest is private, invitation only. Your men are handing out these coins like they were on fire. Is this enough? It's enough to keep us talking. But I'll want to see how well you handle that bow before you go any further. Want a trial round to test your eye? I've had enough practice. Let's begin. A real fanatic you are. Get ready. It's a simple contest here. Hit all targets true before the sand runs down. Here's a new competitor. A Norse from the northern wilds of Mercia. And our current reigning champion, Sayed. All right, take your mark. Hook set. Arrows not. Fire. Deadly aim you have. Best I've seen for some time. Well shot. You have earned your place at the Arrow's side today. He'll be eager to meet you. Hold yourself to the Imperial Arch and speak with our man, Hussa. Recite the phrase. May the Father of Understanding guide us. And he'll know it's you. Arrow is making his speech at the Imperial Arch. On your way now. Are you Husa? Yeah, and who's asking? 
May the Father of Understanding guide us. And may the Mother of Wisdom give us strength. You're to stand just there, look your best when the arrow comes forth, and keep still. Friends, brethren, good people of London, we have had a hard week. Cowardly invaders stole into our governor's home and robbed him of his life. Trigger, my friend, my leader, slaughtered like a dog by outsiders, by the enemy. Do we expect his reap? That's enough! Knocked. It's a hard thing to raise the rats of a city into warriors. Hook set! You raised no one. You only trapped them in their cowering fear. Draw strings! First wave fire! No. I gave these men order. I gave them purpose. I showed them their common enemy. Anchor strings! Second wave fire! I was arrow for their rage. Without a foe to consume, we devour ourselves! He speaks true. A man without an enemy defeats himself. Justify all you want. You're just a king killer and a coward. Mighty high horse, you'd do the same if you were me. Aim and fire! You're unharmed. Praise be to God. It will take more than a few lads with newly polished bows to fail me. The arrow was a boy. A man with a boy's brain called Avgus. Avgus? That can't be right. I could return with his head on a spear if you'd like to see. No. You've no reason to lie. Yet Avgus, my old friend, had no cause to murder. He saw Lunden as a kiln of rage. To harden the softness of its younger men. Perhaps I ignored in him what I hoped not to see. And 
ambition, greed, anger. From one man, such hatred is easy to spot. But from many, it's a fog that fills the room. Power. Men will claw for it and cling to it at the cost of everything. Very true. And it's cold comfort when glory has the taste of your family's blood. Two targets down, only the compass remains. If it were my men killed, I would be on my way to London now. The compass will come, and we must be ready. Expecting the worst. I don't want anyone catching me off guard. Could we take the fight to him? There may be a way. Let's regroup in the church when you've had time to rest, Broger. sister was murdered and where were your guards you hear me okay her blood's on you it's a ruse i tell you it's them that killed Argos was a hero and you let him die a hero for all london they'll hand london to the unwashed tide Some surly guests outside. Eivor! We were... Uh, we, we didn't see you enter. It's about time you found each other. Stop tiptoeing around it. Yes, I've found Stowe and he's found me. And, uh, and here we are. Together. Have you stepped out today? There's a strange feeling brewing in the streets. I've heard the shouts. The deaths of Avgos and Frieswith have angered many. Let's hope the Compass numbers among the offended. I don't doubt it. But are we ready for him? Let's go over all that's happened up till now. Trigger was killed and dismembered by men who worked for him. Men he trusted. Avgos, the Arrow. Our brother-in-arms. He wanted Lyndon for the Order. And the good sister. That's another knife to the back. London Saint. Sister Frieswith. She was the leech, and the city was her meat market. Your bishop has already issued an apology on behalf of the church. It's time we focused on the compass. Gather all we know and lay it out, plain as day. Aye. We let fly the feather dart, squeezed raven ink from a loathsome leech. Now we wait, wolf tensed, for the master of the river rip to return and revenge his shaken warriors. Well, well, this one's got the gift of all its meat. What's on your mind, Stowe? We know the compass is a sailor, a captain from Francia. And he won't like hearing he's got a leak in his hull, so to speak. With the death of the leech and the arrow, you want to hit back, but we can't know how or when. Apart from this, the man's invisible. Coward, if you ask me. Burn in your hell, you bloody reeves! We're pinned in! Is there another way out? The tower! There's an open window they can't have reached! I'll go up. You find a way out. <coughs> Make for the steeple! The yard still spun for us, my stone. We've many years yet. Come on!
fucking shit! Abel, let's get inside! You take your time! We may throw a picnic! Let's go! Fresh air! That's the law on them! Let's get clear of this inferno! I had a view of the city from the roof. There is a new flotilla in the harbor. The compass, bastard. If we commandeered the Springles at Avgos built, we could rain a cloud of arrows on the invaders. I'd sooner take the flank and go around this army to the boats. If we cut the head off this beast, the Order's men will be easy to rout. I will go my own way. Less danger to you both. Whatever happens, this ends tonight. May God guide our souls and cover our backs. Don't be reckless, little voice. We'll see you when it's done, Erke. Count on it. Godspeed, my friends! <coughs> I can't breathe! With an arrow in the dog! My home! Ruin! I am deep in your dead, stranger. Watch out! Arrow! Look out! Afghos and Frida's we were too confident. I don't suffer the same disease. I'll drive. Spread out there, we have this. Oh, woman and child. Ah, 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 Stow and this is lap dog. Stolen. Thank you. Yeah. So this is the compass. Large enough to ford an ocean. Will none of you lift a finger to aid your master? Burning to ash what you cannot possess, that's a child's way out. To hell with London. Udika was right to burn it to the ground. It's a brick and mortar shithouse. So bright and beautiful set aflame. Will you rule over these cinders now? Yoke its people to your whims and needs? You do have power here. Power 
you have earned. I have finished my work in London. That's enough. <laughs> London is only a beginning. My order reaches further than your tiny boats can take you. Never forget, Trigger, my old friend. A man at sea may have gold and glory. But he is always a slave to the churning tides. We are that tide. The drinker we must thank for our good fortune. How do I look? Half drowned and half burned? Not half of either. And far better for the blood on your blade. The compass is dead. London is yours to wreck or rebuild. We will rebuild. We'll strengthen the walls, reunite families, and likely use less wood, more stone. <laughs> Ill-timed, Erke. I'd like a quiet moment to pray. We'll take it together. Until our next meeting, I trust you will heed my call if I should send for you. You came to London in search of a friend, Eivor. You found two. Aye, Broga. And you deserve this. A silver ring for your raven perch. It was Trigger's before he gifted it to me. I say you've earned the right to wear it now. I am touched, Erke. I'll carry it with pride. Tell her the good news.
I should talk to hide them. The Order has been purged from London. For now, they hold no power there. That is good news. And I would celebrate, but for the fact that Jorvik now suffers from the same infestation. Jorvik is a city under Norse control. I should have less problem finding allies here. That is a hopeful way of seeing it. Speak to Ranvi when you wish to travel there. Do you need something? Here. This marks fewer members of the Order. Ah, good. I hope this one did not give you too much trouble. As a token of my deep gratitude, I want you to have this. There are more medallions to collect. Can you remind me what you do here? When you eliminate any member of the Order of Ancients, bring their medallion to me. It will help to keep a tally of how many still live. I have to go. Then go in peace. Greetings. London is with us, and cleansed of the Order. Good. Hytham will be pleased. I want to see the Alliance map. So Chailbert has traveled to Shropshire. He has, into a difficult situation. The Shire has been mired in a long war with Rodri, King of the Britons. Chailbert hopes to negotiate a peace with the Britons of the West. A difficult task for one so green. I hope your tutelage has prepared him well. Indeed. But I think it best if you supervise these talks. If Chilbert can make this work, we will gain a valuable alliance. I'll make my way to Shropshire. I am relieved. He and Ivar should be in Quatford just now. You will find it along the Effen Hafun River. If Ivar is with him, I'll certainly be needed.
você. Go, my eyes. You! You look thirsty as a flaming fish! Drink faster than me, you win the purse! Bring forth your coin! Let's sweeten the pot! Now that's a prize! Ready your cup! Stop a lamb. <laughs> Not half bad, boy. But be fierce. Dirty. Strike at my boss. Eli, are you training the boy or tormenting him? One will lead to the other in time. Eivor, well met. You received my message, and just in time. Our negotiations with the Britons have not yet begun. I'll be at your side when they do. Is there anything I should know first? The venerable King Rodri is here. I am to deal with him directly. Rodri is desperate for peace. Ever since we captured his sniveling brother, Goriad. Sounds like a man coughing up snot. Goriad ap Mervin. Rodri waits at the church nearby. Who speaks for Shirapishaya in these talks? The last elderman was killed in battle. Bishop Deolov is standing in. Until we get this wet whelp installed. That is his father's wish. I find the idea of leading a Shire on my own quite... quite terrifying. It's a grave thing to be Elderman in a time of war, Chelbert. He will piss his pants first thing, that's for certain. As future Elderman, you should speak in the talks as well, but with humility. Rodri is a king, and will expect to be treated as one. Rodri will want us to get down on our knees and sniff the rosy wind blowing from his ass. I know the man. You met him? Met him, fought him. He gave me this nick here. Maybe I can give him one back. Remind him some call me King Killer. It may be you should stay behind, Ivar. That's not a recipe for a good parley. I'd like you both to be there. To guide me, to judge my fitness. Give us your word then. Your blade stays in its sheath. Eifor, don't make me laugh. We both know what my word is worth. But sure, I will let you do the talking. Probably. Excellent. Now, to the church, I think. Our guests await. It's not far, just across the village. We've been at war with the Britons for coming on two years. The Britons had the best of it. 
Tell me and my berserkers plowed through their ranks and chased Rodri's brother into a ditch. That's why Rodri's talking peace now. It's thanks to Eva. I am going to enjoy seeing him squeal, the old oak. Not nearly as much as taking him down, though. That would seal my legacy. Your legacy? As king killer. They do not all get away like Borgred did, Wolfkist. Keep the peace, Ivar. What has become of your preening brother? Ah, uh, my brother. He parted. This road is unsure. You are better off leaving that sauntering pole in your wake. Our Bishop Dealarv and King Rodri are ensconced in the church ahead. These houses of Christ, they're all so hard and cold. Yet within his warmth, the Christian God unites King Rodri, Bishop Dealarv, and myself. On his ground, peace will be made. Britain coward, solemn! Captain Anil, explain to the good bishop our position. Yes, my sovereign. Bishop Dealarv. We are deaf to offers of peace until Guriad is returned to us. The king's brother The has... king's brother is a moldering sack of cow dung. You. I know your face, your stench. Ivar, the one they call boneless. Did I not gift you that scar myself? Ah, you did. And I mean to gift you a gash, you reeking piss pot in your fat fucking skull. Hold! Both of you. Now's not the time for keeping grudges. We're here to smooth a path to peace. Peace, peace, peace. Not with this bag of Britain slop. On that, we are agreed. Now, now, calm everyone. Good faith is all I ask. You know my demands. Until my brother Gwiriad walks free, Peace between us is impossible. He is lucky he can walk at all. Fell on his own blade, fleeing from us. I will soon help you fall on yours. Husband, keep your head. It is in our interest to find a way to peace, all of us. First, my brother. First, your head on a pike. Then the runt goes free. Husband, no! Enough! This is a house of God. Let us take some few minutes to gather ourselves, shall we? Eivor, to me. I do not know you well, but Jailbert believes you a steady head. We need such a one. It may be too late. I see the crows of war gathering. I have a hefty sum of silver. Speak to the people here. If the silver will help one bring us toward peace, offer it to them. These talks are stalled. I fear the upshot. Do not fret. You will be Elderman yet. King Rodri. What is it, Dane? I wish to help you to peace. I will not talk of peace until my brother Gwiriad is returned to me. If you first agree to peace, he will be returned. Would a sum of silver help overleap this difficulty? I cannot be purchased with looted silver, Dane. Stand away. Talk, talk, talk. All we do is talk. You are with Rodri, yes? One of his advisors. I am that. Anir Abkadvar, by name. Address me proper. Tell me, soldier. Do you hold sway with your king? He consults me for his every decision. If I push for war, he will agree. If I argue for peace, he will follow. Peace is our desired end. Is there a chance that some silver might lead you to counsel your king in the same direction? A sack of silver? For me? 
Yes, I might amend my advice to Rodri for a tidy sum of shining metal. Yes. You are a wise warrior. Perhaps the silver will become available. <laughs> and you, go and take a shit and let me know how it turns out. We should settle this with blood, not pretty words. Lady, let us get past the anger and find our way to an agreement. What is your husband's greatest concern? The royal treasury has been depleted by the war. This brings immense strain to Rotary and his every decision. If I could provide a boon of silver, would that guide your husband away from war? A replenished treasury would certainly help my husband come to peace. If such a boon comes, I'll consider your words. No! Ah, enough of this nonsense! Eivor, my friend. I asked around as you suggested. Have you come to a decision? To whom have you given this silver? I have yet to make my decision. Please, don't tarry. You are Guriad, are you not? Brother to King Rodri. So I am. And a bruised pawn in your bloody game. How do you stand with your brother? My brother loves me well. Yet he can be slow and stubborn. Would I, King, I'd have played all this quite differently. What if you had the chance? At the crown. I would leap at the chance to rule. But a man needs wealth to bring down a king. Nobles must be bored, you understand. I make no promises. But I may be able to find you the silver you need. Under what terms? Knock Rodri from his throne. Withdraw all Britain's soldiers from Shiropshire. And never again threaten this border. If you speak true, I would make that bargain gladly. Take the silver. Depose your brother and you'll rule with our support. His blood will gush at my first opportunity. I should report what I know to Bishop Deolav. Ivar! Lock the doors, murder that sweating pig, and have done with it. If I could find you silver, would that quell your bitterness while we seek peace? Peace? Is that what you think is going to happen here? I told you, I know this bastard. Will silver quiet you? It may, it may not. I would have to see the silver in my hands to know for sure. If there is any silver to be had, I'll think about it. You do that. Now you... Eivor, my friend. I spoke with more people. Have you made a decision at last? Eva is increasingly agitated. Rodri's brother will use the silver to take the crown himself by force. He promised rebellion. Are you sure this was wise? Rodri, I see you mocking me! I challenge you! Single Eva, combat no. now! Boneless Ivar. Spineless, toothless, gutless. You cannot kill me! A dragon will be my death, as my seers have foretold. And your brother? Does your destiny guard him? Guriad! <laughs> <laughs> By God Almighty, I'll... Get him to safety! Go! Quickly! Kill the boneless one! Paint this chapel with his blood! Just give up already! Oh, oh, Ivar! What have you done? Goliath won't need the silver now. Ivar! What have you done? <laughs>
Vikinger diplomacy! Show the fuckers who the real warriors are. Eva, ah. you have scuppered the peace. Do not be fooled by peace, boy. It is just an empty voice between axe blows. Dear Lord, this is a massacre. We have no choice now but to fight our way out of this. Ah, a good test for you, boy. Lord, forgive us. Stay close, Jailbert. You watch my back and I will pull the knives from yours. Dear Lord. Stay here, where it's safest, Bishop. Help me with this fucking door! Rachel! 